as I understand it, the goal was just to erase personal emails, but you've recovered emails that wouldn't be considered personal emails at all. Correct. Okay. Um, I don't know that you re didn't recover them, but based upon um, the emails that you recovered, presumably her lawyers or somebody was going well beyond personal emails, is it possible we'll never be able to recover emails that dealt with the Clinton Foundation or dealt with the Benghazi scandal? Is it possible because of what her lawyers did that they were erasing things that were incriminating, maybe uh, involving um, items that you yourself were not particularly investigating, but that these have now been destroyed forever? Is it possible, as I said in my statement on Tuesday, we did not find evidence to indicate that they did the erasure to conceal things of, of any sort. But it's possible, as I said on Tuesday, that there are work-related emails that were in the batch that were deleted. I'm sorry, when you go to this length to make sure you can never recover the emails who are erased, wouldn't you think the intent is to make sure nobody ever looks at them again? Why would you, why, would, why otherwise can you just go thank, to the, I think, the, thank the gentleman, we'll give the director time to, if he wants to respond. You, you know, I guess it's a bit circular. You delete because you want to delete. Uh, but that, that, what I mean is, we didn't find any evidence of evil intent, an intent to obstruct justice there. You wouldn't have been able to, I think, I think because you don't know it was deleted, but. Okay, thank the gentleman.